Thank you for this opportunity, sir. Sir, it takes lots of guts from shifting from engineering background to pursuing a full-time passion. So, like, we have so many responsibilities, like, we have to look after our family, we have to live up to their expectations, and, like, we often doubt ourselves, like, whether it will work or not. So, how do, you, how do we tackle that, sir? One, you know, I recognize all of these emotions that you mentioned. There is a saying which says, bread is okay, it's the butter that brings the avarice. Avarice is greed. So you want to really understand what are the needs versus what are the wants. And I'll give you an example. When I decided to do music full time after I'd finished my masters, I decided to reduce all my needs to a bare minimum where my expenses were very less. Wow. And if almost all the joy I need in life is coming from music, I don't need very much else in you. And what I did was I when I was teaching, even when I was doing my masters at UCSB, I had I had students there. And then when I moved to the Bay Area, some of the students have moved. And they requested me to start teaching them. So I had started to 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 teach them also. Then I had minimum few students. When I called my dad, I was prepared for this. I was like, Baba, I am thinking I should do music full time. He was like, Why did you go there then? <laughs> A natural question, right? right? And he says, how are you going to uh, make your ends meet? Then I said, Baba, I have a few students. I'm able to pay for my rent here. And I'm able to buy my food here. And Purva is okay. So make, if you are planning to uh, pursue your fa passion full time, everyone that matters to you make them your partners in your pursuit you want to make sure you have their blessings and you'll be amazed at how much sacrifice they will do for you more than you can do for yourself and then remember to be grateful after you are successful that's the most important thing yes sir. Great thank answer. you sir Great answer, and, and sir how does it feel like uh, at that place like you're successful now so how does it feel to see your mother happy like <laughs> that feeling, sir. You know, after a while, that's the only thing that matters because every concert people clap. Yes. But to be able to see a sense of satisfaction in the eyes of the audience, some sometimes the audience tears up, sometimes they are overjoyed, they run to you because they want to meet you. Uh, my mother would always sit in the front seat and then my father would sit in the front seat. When I was singing, I'll just do a quick glance to see how they are doing. And right. most often my father was looking at the audience instead of me. <laughs> and that told me that, uh, uh, so, but other than that, you know, look, as I said, and always remember this, even when you are successful, as long as the high from the actual passion is more than the high from the adulation, you are on the right path. Thank you, sir.